Baby? What? Why is the door wide open? Why are there feathers everywhere? Are you okay? Ah, oh, thank the goddess. I was so worried when I came home to see the door wide open. Seriously. What have I told you about inviting strange creatures into our house? Excuse me, they could be vampires, and vampires are terrible house guests. You know they'll never leave. Uh-huh, sure. Like you could kick a vampire out. Sure. Do you remember that werewolf incident? Oh no? Well, let me remind you. I was on a business trip. You know, the one where your uncle called, and we had to chase all those pixies out of the forest behind his house. Yeah, that one. Yes, their teeth really sting when they bite. I had those welts for, what, two weeks? You had to make that awful healing potion. It smelled terrible. It still gives me nightmares whenever I think I hear their wings. Uh-huh. They do have a very distinctive wing flap. I've heard someone did research on several different flying creatures and tried to distinguish why... Wait. I know what you're doing. Don't distract me. See, I knew you remembered the werewolf incident. Don't make me shake my finger at you. I'm not cute! Take that back! I was legitimately worried about you when it happened! I came home, and the door was wide open, just like today. Except at the time, I heard the growling, and then the roof started to collapse in on itself. Yes, the werewolf was bad. They practically destroyed the house. It took forever to find a spell to get everything back in working order. True, the spell is now very handy for when things go boom in the spells and potions room. Back to the point. It was a full moon! You opened our door to a stranger on a full moon! You know better, baby! We live in the middle of the woods. It should be weird when people knock on the door. Shouldn't there be a moment when you think, Oh, you know, Peyton isn't supposed to be back from his trip until Tuesday, and no one has planned for a visit? I'll just open the door without checking who or what is standing there. I know you can handle yourself. Yes, you are a badass witch. As I am. But that doesn't mean I don't worry about you, baby. Don't you worry about me when I'm away? You see? It's a two-way street. I worry about you, you worry about me. But we have each other and we're both capable witches who can take care of ourselves. That still doesn't mean opening the door to strangers and other things that go bump in the night is a smart thing. Well, I don't open the door to strangers. Hold on, let me close the front door. The crickets are going crazy tonight. You always seem to behave and not open the door randomly when I'm home. Fill me in then. What am I missing here? Why did you open the door? Oh, my little moon. I miss you too when I'm away. Come closer, baby. Let me give you a big old bear hug. Hmm. I love the way you smell. Like slightly burnt toast, frog eyes, and cinnamon. I know I've been going out more and more, and I know you can't go without me. We both know you have to stay here. You've got your potion making business. And you still need to stay pretty close to the house, or it will literally walk away. 
we still need to figure out how to remove the spell that makes the house sentient. Why do we let your cousin practice her spell weaving here again? And why did she decide to see if she could give a house legs? Oh yeah! Because we're too nice for our own good. <laughs> Please, don't tell me your cousin is going to become a baby Yaga someday. Those women are terrifying. Huh? No. Baby, I promise. Business has been so good. I'm thinking about hiring a few extra witches to help me out. Who knew that people would need help with so many different creatures running in wild places they aren't supposed to? Well, yeah. Hiring witches means paying them, but it also means being home for longer periods of time. Yeah, of course I want to be home with you as often as I can be. I love you, my little witch. Now, I think we need to clean up this mess. <laughs> yes, we do have a spell for that. You know, you never told me why there were feathers everywhere. Please don't tell me these are from a griffin. <laughs> <laughs> 